Hola mi gente and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Barbie from Barbie Meets World and today I bring to you five healthy habits to adopt not just in 2021. First healthy habit is morning meditation and prayer. Our daily life can be super busy, which like it or not, can cause stress and agitation. Unfortunately, there are many health issues associated with stress, which is why we need to find ways to reduce stress levels and find peace, you guys. Just a few minutes every morning when waking up and before bedtime, meditation and prayer can put us at a more peaceful state of mind. It has been proven by many studies that prayer and meditation harbor benefits such as lowering your blood pressure, your stress levels, and even risk of heart disease. The next healthy habit to adopt is to move your body. Moving your body gets your heart beating and your blood flowing. When blood flows, it carries oxygen and nutrients to all the cells in your body. Bones, 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 mi gente. Bone health is so vital the older that we get. The movement helps make your bones more dense and durable. Also, be sure to do exercises and stretching that feel good to your body. Don't do anything that's going to be straining or will cause pain or discomforts. This will only take you longer to heal and get back on track with exercising and stretching. And another healthy tip that I have for you guys is to focus on your form versus how many reps you do when you're exercising and or stretching. It is so very important that you do not do anything that's going to be too strenuous for your body, especially if you're just starting a new habit or exercising or any type of stretching or yoga of anything of that sort. It's so important to just take care of your body, your bones and your muscles. You do not want to injure yourself, guys. Believe me, I've been there and it takes a long time to bounce back. Healthy habit number three is hydrate. Our bodies, ladies and gentlemen, if you were not aware, is dehydrated when we wake up first thing in the morning. Drinking at least 16 ounces of water rehydrates the body. It allows for better digestion and helps your bowels to move. Being regular is so important and making sure you stay hydrated is even more important, guys. Your body will love you for it, so make sure you get up and you drink your 16 ounces of water. Healthy habit number four, you guys, read the word. It is that simple. Reading the word allows us to seek and know our God. Regularly reading our Bible refocuses our thinking so we may grow in maturity in our walk with Christ. Honestly, with the way things are set up in this world lately, the Bible can give us a strength, comfort, and hope many of us are searching for. And if this is your first time ever opening up a Bible, don't be discouraged. It's okay. I know it can be very scary. We don't know where to start in the Bible. It's not your typical book, but it is the book to actually crack open and start reading. It will really help with your mental, your physical, and emotional state. If you need any helpful tips, if you're looking for a Bible study buddy, 
hit me up in the comments down below. I'm more than open and susceptible to buddying up with you guys. And let's talk about God. It is the best topic to talk about. He really is our Lord and Savior. And the last healthy habit, guys, is to journal. Journaling is so good for your mental health. Remember, what you write down doesn't always have to flow. Even if it looks like gibberish, get it all out. Get all your thoughts out on a piece of paper. Journaling can help with depression, anxiety, and stress. So make sure you invest a little bit of time and money into getting a journal and or notebook of your liking and just get all your thoughts out on paper, guys. It really does help. I hope that you have enjoyed the content of this video and that you're encouraged to give these five healthy habits a try this year. And if you enjoyed today's content, be sure to give me a like, hit that subscribe button, and tap that notification bell for future videos. I thank you guys for your time and I send you guys lots and lots and lots of love, peace, and happiness. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.